Seven at Combo Breaker. Let's get it started. Of course, first to two. First to two, winner side of the bracket. All right, starting it off, you know, again, we were just talking about how how well a knee plays. He doesn't take huge risks here. And, you know, Shaheen, one of those characters that has a punish for almost every single situation. I think mm -hmm. really what's going to just dictate the pace of the match is whether or not Lohai is going to start going for the mix-ups with the hop kick and the slide as well. Yeah, and, you know, knee is one of those players. He's well aware that the crouch dash mix-up is going to be a big part of Shaheen's game. So he's not going to let it get started. Boom, big punish on the hop kick to start things off. Yeah, opting not to go for the ground attack. Good well, break there on the grab. No go. And here we go. Very slow start here, but need now stepping up the pressure. Yeah, yeah, a lot of these options you see from Paul, of course, will go back four, of course, go back one. All these are options are safe. Yeah, not only are they safe, but, you know, he's using the quarter circle back four. He's kind of baiting him to duck, maybe, and then want to build up his offense that way. And look at that. You know, knees just ability to move laterally, the sidestep, the sidewalk game, it, it, it pays off. And, you know, it really kind of shuts down a lot of what Shaheen can do as well. And right now, rage available for Loha. He can make a rage drive, come back, or rage drive, ducks the high. Out of here, round one to knee. Yeah, knee was definitely ready for that, knowing that the second hit is high. Yeah, that is Shaheen's rage drive. It's kind of hit confirmable, but you see it get ducked all day. Yeah, I'm surprised he didn't try to hit confirm it there. Anyways, here we go. Gets the follow up here, goes for the slidey. All right, trying to build up some offense here. He does have uh -huh. a nice lead. That's guaranteed afterwards there. Countered while standing one. Much better round two here but for Lohai. This is where Paul becomes scary. He has access to the rage drive and the rage yard, and of course, extra damage. Yeah, he could totally win just one or two hits right now. Yeah, I hope he doesn't hit me oh with God, it. Oh, God, one hit now. He could totally win this comeback. Oh, oh, he got denied. He tried it. Yeah, he got counter hit right through that. The low kick, able to beat it out. Of course, rage drive not having any armor properties like the rage yard. They probably didn't even have enough life left to survive the rage yard attempt, but here we go. Yeah, definitely not. Oh, now knees opting to go for the tracking moves. You guys see that little homing effect afterwards. That means that move does track sidesteps. He's again. It. Does have a slight light leave here. Man, that wild standing three from Paul. We saw a lot of that at Joey Fury as well. Now Rage available for us. Low high, slide blocked. It is blocked. just so sharp right now. It's going to be really tough. I think low high is going to have to like start taking some risk here. And I hate to say that because, you know, Nee is playing in a way where he's not taking any risk. He's not mm -hmm. gambling at all. But I feel like low high needs to do that to be able to get on the scoreboard here. And right now he's trying to play a game further away from Paul. He doesn't really want to get in there. There's the homing attack again. Stop me from sidestepping. Yeah, and one of the things with Lohai, and especially with Shaheen, he has amazing counter hit ability with the, just the standing oh. four, with the four one as well. But he's not going to be able to do that against Nee, who's playing so compact. He's got the full damage here, looking to close out the first game. Oh, while standing three knee, trying to test him, trying to see what he's doing there in the field. Again, using the knee. Yeah, and you saw that was from the crouch dash again. Nee, not letting him get started, and that'll do it. Nee solidly. Close out game one. Lohai got on the board with one round, but not nearly enough to stop me. All right, we're going to go to stage select. What stage are we going to get here? And I feel like, you know, it would obviously benefit Lohai if he was to get a stage with walls. Are you I calling Hammerhead? Man, Paul with the wall? I don't want to deal and with either that. Either character with the walls, I mean, but it's going to help him out more often than not. If he gets the hits, he's going to hurt even harder, right? Mm -hmm. Twilight Conflict is where we're going to be going. Twilight, Balcony good movie, man. Stage. I like that movie. Oh, yeah? The vampires? You all about mm -hmm. them? Yep, all about Team it. Team Jacob, that's you, Mark? Actually, speaking of which, we might see a vampire uh, later in the bracket. I know Chanel is waiting in the winner's side, ah. and he's been using Eliza almost in the entire weekend. Had to pull out Elisa a few times, but I'm excited to see, of course, which character Chanel is going to pick. Between Chanel and me, the Rocks boys, they use so many characters. It's just really nice to see in the top eight, to see some variety. All right, here we go. The Twilight Conflict. Game number two, Nii in the lead. Yeah, it looks like he might be able to extend it again. This is only a race to two here. Winner semis action. And, and no one really has had an answer for me. No, his, especially his Paul. No mm -hmm. one has had an answer at all since he really started debuting this character in tournament play. No one's been able to take him down. And even when he lost to Book before, he was using Kazuya in that grand final. Yeah. Right? There was no Phoenix for him. Oh, nice. Speaking of Phoenix, that Phoenix Master able to get some extra damage on the combo here. Now, Lohai back to the wall here. This is where the wall's coming to play as Paul oh, gets yeah. a bit scarier. And below high, using the home deck, gets caught with a down forward two, and now knee with the pressure. That could be it. Oh, oh wait a second. The Iron Mountain missed the wow. stuck. And he just threw it out there. Maybe down he back was two, so probably confident that it was going to hit, but knee was obviously ready for it, able to duck it and take that round. Yeah, missed opportunity there for Lohai. 
but now chopping away. I like what I'm seeing here from Lohei. Starting to make some adjustments using the jab, but Knee obviously ready for it using that quick homing move to counter attack with the back one too. Yeah, you mentioned he's got to take more risks here, and you saw that hop kick again. But every time he's tried the hop kick, Knee's blocked and got the full punish, got the knockdown off it. Again, there it is again. You know, Knee's been known to not, you know, duck. He doesn't want to risk getting launched, so he'll take the lows probably, but I feel like. Uh, Shaheen's gonna have to mask it. You know, the slide isn't the fastest move in the game. Oh, without that, Whoa. there we go. Connect the rage drive this time. That should be the round, and there it is. Lohai tying it up again, one round apiece. Yeah, he got, he's on the scoreboard. Let's see if he's able to extend that and probably get a lead in this matchup. But we'll see. It's really tough against the Phoenix. Oh, look at this approach here. But Man, slow, just look at the way steady. he's sidestepping out of the way of everything. Yeah, hey, and he's kind of like, you know, by doing those sidestep, it kind of like limits what Lohai can do in the matchup. Yeah, it's always keeping Lohai guessing what moves he has to throw out because he's got to guess which direction he's going to sidestep in. Oh, and again, the oh, whip punish, God. the counter hit, and the follow up, that should be it. And yes, it is. Knee one round away from moving on to the winner's finals. And that move down back, too, that was the first time he used it in the entire set. Of course, he gets a counter hit with it. Yeah. That's a good way to use it. There's a follow up. There's good block. Yeah, and that's a great punish, of course. Shaheen able to. Able to punish like just like the rest of them with the best of them. But right now, you know, knee hasn't been taking too many risks here. There's a knee again. Shipping away. This is where it gets scary. And so close. Oh boy. And again, these hop kicks are not working out for Loha. Knee now with the wall pressure. Oh, finally a slide for Shaheen. Goes for the grab here, but again, Paul does oh, oh god, my he's gosh. Dead. He's done. The rage drive. Oh my god. I didn't know god. you could drive internationally with the oh gosh. That hurt. Well, that's one way to send a guy to a loser bracket. Yeah. <laughs> I hope you remember that. But man, now Nee moving Ouch. on to our winner's finals. We're going to see him, of course, later on. Now we're going to go to the other side of the winner's bracket where we're going to see, of course,